Yo, what's going on, everyone? This is SLC. Be very. Go. Boom. So, hello, everyone. How's everyone doing? Hopefully, the lighting's okay. Hopefully, y'all can see me. Welcome to SLC. So, again, this is the adventure. The next adventure that we are going to embark on is going to be the hardest reset ever because my plans moving forward after finishing, um, you know, I finished one year at the local university and then I plan to not continue university. However, the conversations that my parents had uh, extremely impactful. For me, it's just, let me just tough it out like an absolute beast, right? So W-I-U, Western Illinois University. Massive certainty, massive certainty, massive certainty. I will say this once and only once, ever. Let the certainty compound. Certainty compounds, right? So now that I have the mindset of not wanting to go through secondary education, quote unquote, the education of a bigger university, since my mindset is not in that, it's gonna be so easy for me to accomplish the actual diploma degree seeking situation because I don't give any fucks at all, right? If I'm balancing, I don't need to balance, right? Because I just go all in on my business, right? Then what happens is uh, having that university experience is literally just just to have it, right? So the reason why I'm not, the reason why I'm gonna be so, um, what is it called? Have so much tenacity is because my mindset is I don't care about secondary education. All I care about is my business. However, the reason why my tenacity is going to be even 10 times fold is because, right, during class, I'm literally going to be doing outreach. You know, during class, I'm literally going to be doing my business. I'm literally going to be building my Patreon, building my fan house, building my OnlyFans, building my Twitter, building my Spotify, building my Instagram, building my TikTok, building my YouTube channel just like this, right? And what's going to be awesome is the audience, right? And the way that I'm going to format these videos, it's literally going to be me documenting and in real time learning how to go about successfully accomplishing university, right? Academic advisor, academic advisor, application. I need to apply, 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 application, application. Do 100, 200, 300 cold calls to one college, to one university, master that university. Then on top of that, right, 200, 300 cold calls to other universities as well. Why? If I am able to have mass knowledge of plethora, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 universities, if I can have knowledge of how to accomplish uh, the system to get my diploma from 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 universities, the one university, the default, WIU, Western Illinois University is gonna be so easy, right? And we talk about this as entrepreneur, right? Volume, 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 volume at scale. If I have a thousand clients, it's gonna be way more complex than just a hundred. If I have a hundred clients, it's gonna be way more complex than just 10. However, if I only had 10 clients, based on scarcity, you make each product a hundred thousand dollars, right? So it's the same thing with university. If I outreach to 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, if I understand the system better than the people running the system, when I go back to default, Western Illinois University, it's gonna be a no-brainer. It's gonna be so easy. I get my degree in my sleep, right? So again, application, application, apply, 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 apply. Academic advisor, academic advisor, academic advisor, housing, 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 tuition, tuition, tuition. In terms of university, you just need to outreach over and over and over again. The reason why entrepreneurship skill is so important, not just as an entrepreneur, but now that I'm going back and embarking onto my university adventures continue, now I have all of this mindset to absolutely destroy the university and get my degree in my sleep, right? Because if you think about entrepreneurial outreach, right? I talk to business owners all the time and 
business owners don't care about you. All they want is more money, right? It's the same with university. The university doesn't care about students. All they want is more money. So if that's the case, in terms of sheer volume and tenacity of outreach, I'm gonna be able to learn the system so much faster, so much easier, with so much finesse, because I already don't give any fucks about outreach, because I already don't give any fucks about the system, because I already don't give any fucks about how to apply education to my body to register, right? So if that's the case, the degree seeking is gonna be, like I said, so easy in my sleep, because I've already done so much rigorous entrepreneurship personal development, self-improvement, work, progress, that when I go back into the default trenches of university life, it's gonna be so easy, right? Because I've already been living a more, like I've already challenged myself into a more difficult life by being an entrepreneur, that when I quote unquote low vibrate into university, it's gonna be like smooth sailing. Everyone, my name is SLC, and this video definitely helps.